Hey guys, what's up? Johnny Kinsvater here with Concert Addiction with some very exciting news. They broke yesterday, so of course, yes, I'm getting this video up late and I'm aware of that. I'm sorry, just kind of had a busy day yesterday. But I'm super excited to share with you, haven't or if you haven't already heard, that uh, ELO, the Electric Light Orchestra, is going to be doing a U.S. tour for the first time in over 35 years, I guess. Which is crazy to me. Now branded as Jeff Lynn's uh, ELO. They kind of made their comeback a couple of years ago. I believe it was 2014. Um, they played two uh, shows, two U.S. shows uh, last year, I believe. But as far as like a large scale tour, it's been some time that, since they've done that, especially on U.S. soil. But this week uh, they're releasing a uh, live album slash uh, concert film called Wembley or Bust, and this announcement comes just before that, so that that announcement's going to come on the, or that album's coming out on the heels of this announcement, which is a very smart way to do it. And, uh, yeah, they, they've kind of been teasing this for a while for the past couple weeks. They've had this thing going around, where's the ship going to land? It had the ELO UFO deal on it, and it's kind of a teasing, teasing kind of thing. So we all knew this was coming, and I'm super excited about it, especially because they're coming near me. Um, but anyways, yeah, so after 35 years, they're coming back, and they're going to play a U.S. tour, uh, which is pretty cool. I got the, the announcement here. Uh, they're going to be playing the... The tour starts in Oakland and ends in Philadelphia. I might actually go see it in Philadelphia. I haven't decided yet, even though Denver would obviously be closer to me. But they're hitting all the main cities. Uh, Los Angeles, Denver, Houston, Dallas, Rosemont, Detroit, Toronto, New York. They're going everywhere. So they don't have too many dates, and there's no words on if they're this is going to be it or if they're going to do this from now on, if this is a comeback tour, or if this is just like a reunion thing they're going to play and then they'll be done. Uh, we don't know, but these guys are obviously getting getting up there in age, too. Um, so we don't know how much touring they'll actually be doing after this. But surely they're definitely going to be a not a can't-miss kind of show just because of the fact that this is the first time they're playing in 35 years. So, yeah, pretty excited uh, rock and roll Hall of Fame group. Uh, in high school, I made a woodshop project. I engraved the logos of apparently what my favorite bands were um, when I was in high school I guess and on there I have Nickelback, yeah, Three Doors Down, uh, Kiss, Motley Crue, all these bands and ELO and ACDC so ELO and ACDC are the only two on that board that I have not seen live yet so I'm looking forward to being able to check one of them off hopefully someday soon probably not but I'll be able to check off the other but yeah there you go that's pretty much the big news that's dropped uh, today and yesterday was that uh, yeah Jeff Lynn's ELO is touring the United States for the first time in 35 years. So yeah, pretty big news. Uh, if anything else happens, I'll make another video talking about that. But until then, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video. Also check out my Facebook page and my website, facebook.com slash concertaddiction and concertaddiction.com. Never miss anything going on in the world of live music. I know there's some festival lineups coming out this week. We'll make sure to post them on the Facebook page. And uh, make sure to comment on this video, join the conversation, comment on the Facebook page too. Let's get Get this thing going. We love conversations. So, yeah, until next time, thanks for watching. Bye.